Good evening, everyone. Hello, hello. How are you tonight? Let me adjust my computer just a little bit here. Welcome. Thank you for being here. How's everyone doing? Let's see. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Jess from Utah. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Nikki. Hello, everybody. Oh, just got birthday vibes today, and I'm already making cards. Love to hear that, Jess. That's awesome. Hi, Cheryl and Christine and Michelle H. Michelle Holbrook, Michelle H. Are you the same people? Or are you both Michelle H's? <laughs> Hi, everyone. All right. So thank you for tuning in tonight. This is an unusual time for me to do my um, Facebook and YouTube live tonight for MFT. But I'm all, I'm gone all day tomorrow. I'm working the election here in Georgia. And so I am not available to do our normal 2 p.m. on release day live stream. So we're doing it tonight. So that's a great little um, prep. We can call it a pre-release party. We're having a little pre-release party here to show you um, what's coming tomorrow from the vault so that you can get ready to shop if you love everything like I do because everything is so awesome and so cute. And so if you saw the sneak peeks over the weekend and today, what we're doing is we're opening the vault and bringing back some Lena Lamb stuff from some years ago that has been so requested, especially the sneaker has been so requested over and over and over we're like okay we need to we need to make the people happy and bring that one back so if that's one you guys have been waiting for now's the time tomorrow's the time so i'm going to go ahead and walk through this whole release tonight and just show you what's what so that you can um see if you love it as much as i do all right so i have a few samples that i made to show and then i put some of the samples from the um, design team on slides to show. Yay, Sherry is so excited for this vault release. I am too. I'm going to put that right on the screen because I agree. <laughs> this is a good one. Uh, they're all good ones, honestly. <laughs> but this is this is one that has been in much anticipated. I'll put it like that. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and go to my overhead camera without any further ado. There we go. And I'm going to get my mouse out of the way here. And um, <clears throat> let's see, I'm gonna have to find a place to put this though, because I'm gonna be going back and forth with my mouse. And I wanna thank Ashley from uh, MFD, who is here in the comments as well. Let me see, I'm just gonna straighten things out a little for you guys, there we go. Um, she's making comments both on um, Facebook and YouTube, because we stream to both places so that you can, um, you know, if you have questions or if you need links, she's putting the links in the comments. So I wanted to mention that we have our shopping list. So if you're so inclined, you could always grab this. It was linked today in our blog post. And it's just a little checklist that you can use to check off the things that you love so that you can remember what they were. And so we do put that together for you guys every, every month, every release to help you, um, you know, figure out what you love. And also so you know all the names of the products if you wanted to go and you could use it as a little reference when you're organizing your new goodies, but we also put labels available on the website for every release as well that you can use on your on your packaging. So yay for that. All right. So um, Linda, are you raising your hand because you have a question? If so, Ashley's there for you. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and dive into the release. And we're going to start with what I mentioned, which is super anticipated. And I already used it. So I have it on a little magnet sheet, sheet here. Um, this is the, um, the official name of this. Let me get it right here. The official name is All Star High Top. I don't want to use the brand name because, you know, this is just an All Star High Top. And I love that it has all the cute things to do your layering to build up your little die cut. And so it has this piece that goes here. Just try to picture what I'm doing. And then I'll show you some examples as well. That piece layers there. There's this little. Uh, thing right here that goes across to add a little strip of black or color to your <laughs> to your shoe. This little piece right here took me a minute to figure out what it is, but it goes right here at the heel. So it just has all these great little pieces to layer it together and make this fun shoe. This goes right at the front of it, right there. And then of course it has the cute little circle to go on the side. It has all these cute little eyelets that you can cut out. I mean, when you add these little eyelets, it really takes it up a notch. It looks so cute once you have all those there. And it has the little lines kind of um, cut into the die cut, but not cut, just the impression. So you know where to put all those little eyelets. And once you put those all on there, it just makes it so stinking cute. Um, is it the same size as the original? I'm going to guess yes, but I don't know for sure. But I would guess yes. If Jody happens to be here, maybe she can tell us or maybe Ashley knows. But um, I think it's the same size. I'm pretty sure. 
Now to go along with it, because you have, you know, a place to stamp on the shoe itself and then to have some greetings to go with it. Ooh, I'm trying to find a piece of paper to put behind this that doesn't have writing on it and I don't have any, let's see. I can use the back of my shopping list here. So you can see this, this set here is called High Top Sent Sentiments and it just goes perfectly. Like I mentioned, it has these three little stamps that can fit right in that circle to put on, on your shoe. Those fit in there perfectly. And it is a stitch circle. So you can use that for other things, but it's a cute little stitched adornment to your shoe. And then all these really fun messages. You can also put these fun little icons on the side of the shoe or on the background of your card, anywhere on your card, really. Super duper cute. Um, yeah, I agree. It's one of my favorites of all time as well. And a lot of people who missed it were sad. So now we have it again. And I love the messages. There's young at heart. Um, me without you is like a sneaker without laces, be authentic, be different, soulmate, stand for something, be an, and you can say be an original, um, you are an original, you were an original before it was cool, you're an original all-star, you were, you can say you were an original before it was cool, um, you are a soul sister, uh, you're my favorite dude, one step at a time, be original. There's the you are my, you are my soul sister. All right. So lots of mix and match, cute little messages that you can use with this absolutely adorable shoe. Um, let's see. Okay. Ashley's confirming it is the same size. All right. Cool. Cool. All right. So I was obsessed with the shoe and I stayed up making shoes until the wee hours <laughs> because I couldn't stop. I mean, look at these. They are so stinking cute. So I made a whole rainbow of them. See, 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 cute, cute, cute. And then I even got out my glitter card stock and made a purple glitter shoe because I mean, I need this in my life, honestly. <laughs> Absolutely love it. So there's the little star here in the stamp set. I mean, in the die set, sorry. And so I put that right on top of the star that gets stamped from this. Didn't have to put the stars, but I just thought it was cute die cut out of the same color. And then you can see all these fun little eyelets. They look like metal eyelets, honestly, but they're just paper. And so I was just putting them all on there. I will say that that is the, you know, <laughs> the slowest part of putting together this die is that all those little eyelets, but it, cut, it cuts out all 10 at once. So the two here and then all along there, that one die cuts them all out. And so you just have to have a teeny tab of, of patience to get them all on there, but they're so cute and so worth it. And I just love it. So yay for all that. Let me show you what some of the members of the team made. Yeah, Nikki, I was busy. <laughs> I was just making shoes. <laughs> all right, let me go over here. I have to use my mouse. Sorry, guys. So here is a card that was made by Carly on our team. And the other thing I didn't do on my shoe, and I just wanted to point out, is any kind of twine or string or ribbon you have in your stash is so adorable to actually thread through those eyelets, through the laces, and then have it on your shoe. And I really love how Carly did like a, 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 a gradation of ink and you know some ink blending on her panel. You could use um, colored cardstock, pattern cardstock glitter paper like I did. I have some backgrounds. I like to keep a bin of backgrounds, just random backgrounds that I create. And I think cutting some of those out with the shoe would be so fun to have all kinds of funky shoes. So I'm gonna do that as well. I'll show you that in a second. And then here is one from Han and I just love her pink high top. I love how she used the lighter pink and then the, the um, popping pink for the, the highlights on it and the little star, so cute. And then the bright pink is also on the word all star on her message. Super, super fun. And then this one is from our friend Nikki in the comments. She did a cute pink high top as well. I love the, it's kind of almost like a yarn is her, her string that she used on that. And um, it's just so cute with those big bows. And then she did the black accents on her shoe. And then I just love that she put it with a grass dye uh, from MFT and just so cute. Such a cute, cute little card. And I'm, you know, I make lots of shoes, but I'm bad about putting them into final cards. <laughs> so I have a million cards I can make now with all these shoes I made. So I just want to point out that these products will be available separately tomorrow, but you can also grab the bundle. If you are wanting both of them, they will be available tomorrow as a bundle. So that's a great way to get the cute, cute goodies. Now, let me see what y'all are saying. Lots of comments talking about how cute everything is. Yeah, the string takes it up a notch. I need to dig out my string. If you guys have been here with me live before, you know that I redid my craft room and I still haven't unpacked everything. So I'm like, 
huh, I wonder where my string is. I don't know, my twine. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to find it. Um, the price of the bundle, let me see if I even, hold on one second here. Uh, actually, Ashley might be a better person to grab that info, but let's see if it's in the coming soon on the website. Um, the bundle will be $33.28, which is a savings. The full price if you bought them separately is $36.98. So you do get a few dollars off if you buy it as a bundle. So if you look today on the coming soon section of the website, all of these things are there. They say notify me and then tomorrow they'll be moved over to, into the new section. And so then you'd be able to, um, you know, you could notify me right now so you get a reminder tomorrow at 10 a.m. when they become in stock. But that is when they release, 10 a.m. Eastern tomorrow. So, um, yeah, so many people that you can do a card for these girls, boys, young and old, everybody. Um, is it on the shopping list? That's a good question. Yeah, you guys. Duh. <laughs> Thank you. You guys, it's 8 p.m. here. I'm tired. <laughs> I didn't even think. Yes, I could just flip over my, my uh, paper and there are all the prices. So yes, they're totally there. So smart. Such smart customers we have and fans and people watching this live. <laughs> all right. All right. So that is the fun, super fun back from the, the vault. The vault. Um, yep. Fun, fun, fun. We love these so much. All right. Now, there are a lot of other fun things in this release that I want to walk you through. And the first is bundle of baby clothes. Have you guys seen our bundle of baby clothes? It is so adorable. I still have the dyes on here because I was too busy making shoes. I didn't make anything with this one. <laughs> but you can see it has little um, a little onesie. It has a little dress, a shirt, little bib overalls, a bib, another bib, little bows that you can use, stars, a hanger, just lots of clothes that you could put on the line for this one. And there's two different strings that you can hang all these clothes from. And it's just so, so sweet and so cute. And it's great for baby cards, um, you know, all kinds of things. You could just use the dress for something for a little girl, a bib, the bib overalls for a little boy. You could decorate this T-shirt with all kinds of things, even use some of the same messages from that other set about being an all-star, right? Because there's a star on that shirt. And I think those are separate. You don't even have to have the star on the shirt. They could be totally separate. Um, and then again, there's messages that kind of coordinate really well with this. So let's talk about those. Perfect for the money card set. That's true. That would be great to use together, especially for a shower gift. And uh, I hope you guys can see that. Okay. It looks a little dark on my screen, but um, there, I love this one. You two will be amazing parents. That is such a nice message to give at a shower, especially if it's a couple shower. Um, you are amazing. You made a person. <laughs> love that one too. Um, uh, let's see, there's a congrats and then it says on your really tiny, really big news, you're going to be the best parents ever. Congrats on having the cutest baby in the history of all time. <laughs> I love these messages. They're so good. The laundry is about to get super cute. That's so, I love that too. Awesome. Awesome people make awesome babies. Um, welcome to the world, baby. High fives and naps for all. Together, you've made something beautiful. You're invited to a baby shower and I can't wait to meet you. Those are all so good. They almost make me tear up. They're so good because <laughs> my babies are now teenagers. I can't believe it. But if you guys don't know, Ashley in the comments here as MFT, she has a sweet little baby, sweet little baby girl. And so it makes me want to make all these messages on a card and send them all to, all to Ashley because she has the most beautiful little girl, baby girl. So very, very cute, very sweet. Um, the message set is called Welcome Baby, and the die set is called Bundle of Baby Clothes. So now, yeah, that's a great message, isn't it, Michelle? Michelle said that her favorite, my favorite sentiment is the laundry is about to get super cute. <laughs> I agree. Um, Ashley's baby is going to be three months this week. <laughs> Girl, if you think it's going by too quick now, just you wait. <laughs> that doesn't help, I'm sure, with your tear situation. I'm sorry. But my my baby, my youngest, my baby girl uh, just got her driver's license this weekend, which is just uh, overwhelming, right? So here is a mock-up showing all those cute clothes. There's a heart and there's a star that you can use to decorate. You can put the bib overalls over the t-shirt. Um, you know, there's even that, I didn't mention it when I was looking at it, but there's a, the little rectangle that's like a little clothespin, just a little die to hang on there on the line. So cute. 
And then here is an example from Han. So sweet. And again, she used the clothespin. She used some of our um, scalloped and stitched and framed eyes to build up her little scene, which, you know, using that rectangle um, framed eyes from the vault in February works perfect as a little vignette or a little place to hang your clothes. And there's that message that we were just talking about. The laundry is about to get super cute. <laughs> and here is a wonderful card from Nikki. I love how bold her colors are. Baby stuff doesn't have to be all blue and pink and, and pale and pastel. I love how bold this is. I love her little polka dots. Um, we have a ton of different pattern papers that would be so fun to die cut these things from plaids and stripes and dots and all kinds of things. I love how Nikki repeated that little star die cut on her onesie. That is so cute to have the stars all over it. Super cute. And again, these are available tomorrow separately, or you can pick them up together as a bundle. And I will turn over my sheet and tell you that as a bundle, they will be 32.38. So it'd be a little tiny bit more separately. I can't remember what the percentage off is. I don't remember my math right now, but it is a good deal if you grab them both at once. Okay. I missed a whole bunch of comments again, so let me look through these. Um, my most used set, ah, <laughs> Yeah, your baby girl is a treasure, uh, Ashley. Okay, yay, yay for more cute stuff. Now, let me see what I have next here. Next, I love this too. You guys, I just love everything. I know I get, I'm a broken record sometimes on these lives because I just say the same thing over and over, but look at these flamingos, <laughs> they're so cute. And I love that there's two of them and they can be looking at each other with a heart. So cute. I haven't taken those apart. I was just putting them together through the die cutting machine all, all together. But And then there's all these different legs you can use. So you can have cross legs, just standing legs. And then these are just like poles. So if you wanted to make it look more like a lawn flamingo, I just love that. You can make it, you know, it doesn't have to look like a real flamingo. You can make it look like a lawn flamingo as well. These pieces here cut the beak uh, to make it a layered, colorful beak if you want, wish to. And then these are the, um, the wings that can be popped up or layered on there to give it some dimension. And again, this beautiful heart that I just think is a really great heart die that I will use over and over. And then again, great flamingo themed messages. We have anything is possible with sunshine and a little pink. <laughs> so cute. I'll stand by you. We flamingo so well together. What makes you different makes you beautiful. That's beautiful. Tickled pink that it's your birthday. Fabulous is a frame of mind. Hope today tickles you pink. Life is better with friends. And pink makes anything fabulous, which by the way is like a motto for MFT, right? Because Pink is our color. We love pink at MFT. So this flamingo set and all the pink messages are just really on, on brand for MFT. <laughs> and I did have some fun making flamingos. Let me go ahead and just pick these up and show you how cute they are. <clears throat> Again, I didn't put them on a card, but I was just having fun with them. And I made some, I was, you know, die cutting pinks and uh, light pinks and dark pinks. So I used the opposite oops on these. I did the two different kinds of legs on them. Um, here is with the size of the heart. If you're curious, you could have it up there. You could have it down between them. There's another one that I did in black. And you can see also an example of how those dyes make the little um, beak, layered beak. Now, I will say when you cut this out, the little dot of the eye um, comes out. You can see that it is a piece that will come out of that, that, um, the eye, whatever. <laughs> and what I did to easily put that back in is I just snipped with my scissors, a little piece of like the yellow best ever craft tape or whatever, some little tape. And I just put it on the back and that just made it an easy place to hold that little eye in when I paper pieced it back in. And so I did a black, black eye in the pink flamingos. You could do blue, you could do whatever color you want, of course. Aren't the flamingos so cute? I just love them so much. <laughs> Is there anything that MFT makes that I don't love? Hmm, I don't think so. <laughs> um, all right, so let me go ahead and show you. Let's see, um, here's a mock-up, which is kind of exactly what I just showed you, except for they made the pink uh, beak and the pink legs. I did a orange on mine, but same kind of idea. And here's an absolutely stunning card from Nikki. I just love it. I kept staring at it today because it's so gorgeous. I love that she did some ink blending to make her um, 
flamingos have a little more life in them than mine are just plain cardstock. She used a little white gel pen on the arm, not the arm, the wing. <laughs> and then she took some of our uh, greenery and flower dyes to put be, uh, below the flamingos, which is just so pretty. And that beautiful ink blended oval in the background, that beautiful heart. So just love this card so much. I just, I don't know. I think also all the lace and ribbon, everything behind it, everything about it just makes me swoon. <laughs> it's so pretty. And then again, the message and the die set you can get separately tomorrow, but it will also be available together as a bundle to save a little money if you know you're going to get both of them. Okay, now what is next? Let me see here. I have to go back and forth between to see your comments. Hit the like button. Yeah, if you're on YouTube, hit our like button. We would love that. That helps people find this live. Let me get my flamingos out of the way. <clears throat> and I hope it's helpful for you guys to have this little live overview of the products. So you know what's coming and you can, you know, you know what, how much you have to exercise your wallet. <laughs> right. Um, yeah, these are all from the vault. So these are, you know, if you look, if they look familiar to you, if you have them in your stash already, it's because you've been a fan for a long time and they are from the vault. So I love that they come back for those of us who are more new to MFT or missed them the first time around. So I did use a little, I use this class of dye already because I was working on some things because not only do I have a 16 year old who just got her driver's license, I also have my son who is 18 and is graduating in just a couple months. I can't even believe it. And so this is very um, fitting for that. Um, so we were, I was helping a friend make a um, graduation board for her son because he's in a the school play and they are having them for the hallway um, at the school. And anyway, so I was helping her make a photo board. And so we did a 2024 and put the class of on there. So what this does is it has a diploma and it has a um, cap, cap, cap and gown. Yeah, cap. Um, you can see it has the board for the top of the cap that you can do separately. So you have two different colors and the tassel on the cap is separate as well. So you can layer that together. And then this diploma has a band that goes around it and then two little um, pieces coming down like it's a ribbon around it almost. Now this cuts on the edge, which is really cool. And um, let me see how long that is. Let me grab a piece of, <laughs> uh, let's see, grabbing just a piece of paper to hold up against that because I was curious about the size. It looks like it would probably cut exactly on an A2. So you could have the edge of your card have congratulations, which is really cool. I feel like I should cut that out and show you because I think that is really, really cool. So let me do that. <clears throat> so I'm gonna have to snip, snip, snip. All right, and there are messages as well. I'll show you that in just a second here. Right, so if I have it like this, I meant to get this done prior to the live. I'm sorry I didn't, but I do want to just show you because I think it is cool. <laughs> um, yeah, there's a lot going on in our family right now. <laughs> My son is still figuring out where he's going to go to college. Still waiting on some news from one of the schools he applied to. So I don't know. It's just a lot. It's a lot lately, you guys. <laughs> I did it, you know, I guess that's the right way. Okay. For a second there, I thought I did it wrong, but no, this, this is totally right. And I think it's so cool. So see how that cuts along the edge there. And so you can have that right on the edge of your card, which just looks so cool. <laughs> you could have it going that way if you wanted to. Um, I kind of like the idea of having this be the, you know, into the front of your card, if it was a full layered card and having maybe like white behind it or whatever your school colors are. And then you could see that peeking through on the side. I just think that looks great. And by the way, it's congratulations. So you could use that for everything. It doesn't just have to be anything. You know, it doesn't have to be graduation. We were just talking about new baby. That's congratulations as well, right? So there's lots of things that you could use the word congratulations for. And I just think that's a really fun and cool die. And I love it a lot. I realized I had that upside down. So... Let me just show you, no, actually, let's first talk about the message set that coordinates well with it. And then I'll show you some mock-ups of this stuff. 
<clears throat> okay. So this one is called Happy Graduation. By the way, the flamingo was called flamingos and the stamp set was called tickled pink. I don't think I mentioned that. The stamp set is called Happy Graduation and then the dies are called Graduation Accents. And so the messages on this one are so very proud of you. Look out world, happy graduation. Wherever you go, go with all your heart. Reach for the stars. By the way, keep that in mind because that will go with some other things in this release. Hats off to the graduate. You can make that fun little graduation hat and use that. Uh, nice hat <laughs> um, for the grad. Congrats. Here's to a bright future. Way to go. Hashtag way to go. Hashtag senior. And I actually used that hashtag senior last night as well because I was making some decorations for my son's soccer team senior um, dinner with the coaches that's coming up next week. I made little jerseys and then I put the hashtag senior above their numbers, which is I thought was fun. And it was great that I had this fun die to use. This is my mouse. Sorry, guys, but I have to go over and show you guys these mock-ups and stuff. So this is what the cap looks like and the diploma looks like when you build all those little pieces together that I mentioned. And again, separate tomorrow, but you can also buy this together as a bundle if that interests you. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you the next bit of products because our team made some really fun um, combined um, projects with the thing. So let me show you here. Get this out of the way. So the next couple things are a light bulb, which is called Light Bulb Dynamics. Super clever, unusual name, right? <laughs> light Bulb Dynamics. I love this because you can layer up your cute little bottom of your light bulb. And then it has two different things that you can put in your light bulb. The little heart-shaped coil or just a regular kind of coil for your light bulb. Really, really cute. And then the messages that go with this one are, because of you, my world is brighter. What's up? <laughs> That's cute. What's up? I just had a light bulb moment. Your future is bright. Look on the bright side. Uh, say what? You're brilliant. Let your light shine. You, and then you could say, you know, there's mix and match here. Bright idea. Um, you brighten my day. Um... You is with you shine. I'm like, I want to make sure I understand what that you is for, but you can put you shine together. Super fun, super cute. And again, let me just go over here and show you these, how you would put it together. So cute, so, so cute to have the, you know, different colors on there. And then I wanted to show you the cards from the team because they took the cap from the other set and put it on the light bulb. <laughs> Isn't that cute? And two of them had the same idea. This is from Carly. I love that she made a cute little shaker with it, with that light bulb. There's some sequins down in there. And then she said, your future is bright because I think all this light bulb stuff and the messages in that set go really, really well with graduation, but it doesn't have to be graduation because there's lots of other stuff in there too that you could use for other occasions. And here's one from Laura and I love her little cap on her um, light bulb as well. Uh, here's to a bright future. Her bright is so cute. She must have done some um, maybe embossing powder on that to make it so bold. And how about her cute little uh, troll back in the background? <laughs> so cute. So these two are together as a set. Like I mentioned, it's a bundle tomorrow. And then this is together as a bundle as well. So there are two different bundles or you can buy all four things separately, of course. All right, so let's see what you guys are thinking of all this. Um, oh my goodness, Carol, your firstborn granddaughter's graduating from college. Where does the time go? I don't know. <laughs> oh, Fabby, borrowed, let a friend borrow hers and never got it back. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> um, oh, you, Michelle has, okay, what's the chance of this? Two brothers who do lighting for their business. You absolutely need this to make cards for them. <laughs> that's perfect. Um, yeah, there's so much great stuff in this um, uh, vault to release tomorrow. Um, let's see. Question about the rewards. I'm going to leave to Ashley because I don't actually know the answer to that. Um, yeah, the mortar board. Thank you. Thank you for I, I called it a board, but I forgot mortar board. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Um, let me take this off the screen and let's look at the next because we're not done, guys. There's there's even more in this release. So let's talk about what else there is. Now this whole, this next, it's four products that all basically go together or not. You can have them separate as well, just like everything else. So here's a beautiful stamp set with star, wish, stars. 
it's mix and match. I'm just going to read the thing and you can kind of think of how it would go with these, these messages down here, right? I thank my lucky stars um, for you. I thank my lucky stars for you. Um, you are my sun, my moon, and all of my stars. When you count the stars, begin with yourself. You're my shining star. Look how they shine for you. It's like, you know, look at the stars, look how they shine for you. When it comes to being awesome, you get a gold star. You aren't just a star to me. You are the whole night sky. Oh my gosh, I love that. Uh, make a wish, because there is wish in here. Shoot for the stars. Uh, be the star you are. Uh, wish big. There's a little big there. There's these cute little, um, I like that these are kind of drawn stars rather than the outline of a star, if that makes sense. You know, the shape of a star, it's like the, the one you would draw. And there's several things that go with this. First of all, we have some frame dies um, that would, you know, blob dies that go around the words to cut them out. So you can stamp them and cut them out with this. Um, this one is called, let me get the names of stuff here. The stamp set is called Count the Stars, and this is called um, Star. No, this one is called Count the Stars Dynamics, of course, because it's the same as the stamp set. Ooh, brain. <laughs> so you can cut out the, the words, but then there's also Stars and Wishes, which, where did I put it? Here it is, is the dies that cut out those same words from cardstock or paper, whatever you want to cut it from. And then you can put the frame around that, the shadow, so that you have those to use together. All right. So can you picture the difference in those? This can be used with this. This can be used with this. And then we have more of those wonderful stars. And I just love these stars. So cool. I can see how I would um, love to cut these out of like some gold mirror cardstock. I think would be gorgeous. Have a blue um ink smushed background with you know and then put the stars on top of it i think would be so pretty this one is called lucky stars okay so all four of these kind of work well together and i just i adore them so much now let me show you some things here <clears throat> here's that example i was trying to talk you through of how um, the one on the right is the stamp set and then picture using <clears throat> the, the outline dies to make a shadow behind the stamped words. And then the one on the left is the two die sets together, cutting out the words from cardstock and then a shadow from cardstock as well. If that makes sense, hopefully it does. Um, you can get that all four things together in this case as a bundle tomorrow, if you wish, or all four things will be available separately. And then this is a um, example from Sindhu. And I love how she die cut that and just use the outline part of it. She didn't use, you know, there would have been a positive and a negative. She used her negative here with some beautiful ink blending and splattering in it. And so you can use it in multiple ways. So do you understand what I'm saying here with this one? So this was is going to have like the shape of a star left in your cardstock. But then she also probably had this little outline piece as well that she could use for something else. So she just, she just used that to cut into her panel rather than using the actual positive that came out of it. <laughs> all right, let's see. Let's see what we're all thinking here. Um, so what do you guys think? Uh, is there anything that you especially love from this release? So, so awesome. So there is a whole uh, caboodle <laughs> tomorrow. It's We're calling it the mega bundle of the Lena Lamb Design Vault release. And this one is... A great savings. Let's see here. Um, so for all the things in that big bundle, it is going to be $195.64, which is full price would be $260.85. So it's a great savings. I, I don't know the percentage off the top, but you know, it's a big savings to get it all together in one huge bundle. Okay. So guys, what is your favorite from this release? Do you have favorites? Um, <laughs> you, some are, uh, have been fans too long and you already have them, but hey, you could you, you could like be honorary design team members and use this stuff that's in your stash and share, you know? I would love to see what you make with them if you already have them. Get them out and use them and post them because I would love to see if you post that. If you're not one who posts online, don't worry about it. <laughs> but if you are, we'd love to see that for sure. Um, the high tops are Kathy's favorite. Cheryl needs it all. Rebecca has purple hearts because I, 
I love Purple Hearts. <laughs> um, uh, oh, there's some more requests for <laughs> more Lena Lamb. I don't know. You know, this stuff, honestly, it came out because um, we uh, keep getting requests for, especially the, the sneakers. That's been the hugest one. But all this stuff, we've been getting requests to bring it back from the vault. So we do truly listen. So if there's things that you want to see come back from the vault, you know, just let um, customer service know. Hello at MFT Stamps. Or if you can go on social and leave a comment as well. So yeah, so let's go back and look again. We have the cute little light bulb and the messages that go with it. We have the graduation. Um, let me say the right name so you guys know what to look for. The light bulb is called light bulb, the WhatsApp set. I love that name, WhatsApp. Um, we have, excuse me as I rustle my papers here. <laughs> um, we have the happy graduation stamp set and the graduation accents dies. Oh guys, oosh, I almost forgot. We have one more thing in this. That's not everything. We have one more thing in this release and it is this set, which is called Stay Tuned. And this is just a stamp set. There's no um, die with this one. But if you remember last month in our um, main February release, we had this adorable classic TV. And these from Lena Lamb's vault are all great things that can go with that TV. So we thought this was a fun one to bring back so that there could be some messages for the TV, the classic TV that you may have picked up last month. And so it has, I think you're a hit, our top story, things will be better soon, breaking news, happy birthday, please stand by, stay tuned for an important message. I love that we have fun doing nothing. <laughs> news flash, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, we live happily ever after, <laughs> that's cute. And you could say, you know, breaking news, happy birthday, news flash, happy birthday, stay tuned, something amazing is coming right up. And it says there's a gift card inside. <laughs> so again, you could combine this with money card. You could put a TV on your money card and you could put some of these messages on there, which would be super cute. Um, it says this is only a test. If you guys remember the emergency broadcast system. And if you don't know, um, let me just show you. This is a card I made last month with the TV <clears throat> where I just used purples because I love purple. And so I picked a message from an another old set, older set. And now I could put the same card and have one of these fun little messages on it. So this goes really great with the classic TV. All right. Um, Ashley saying, if you have any other questions, you can always email her at hello at mftstamps.com. Um, yeah, the stay tuned message is so great for the classic TV, isn't it? All right. So yes, I was going back. I almost forgot that wonderful set. Oh my goodness. And of course, where did I put the rest of my stuff? Here they are. <laughs> <clears throat> We had our flamingos. We had our cute little baby clothes and the messages. And here are the flamingos that I made. I'll just add them to the pile. <laughs> They're so cute. Um, <clears throat> and then of course we had all the shoes, all the shoes with the high top sentiments and the um, all-star high top dynamics, which was the absolute fan favorite of Lena Lamb. So look for all this tomorrow. Our release is at 10 a.m. tomorrow. Um, let's see. I'll go back to me for a second here. But lots and lots of fun stuff in this release. So much stuff I still want to play with. <laughs> I just, I spent all my time making shoes because <laughs> I couldn't stop. I couldn't stop myself. They were so cute. All right. I see Kim loves the high tops the most. Yep. All right. Thank you guys for being here tonight. And again, this all goes live at 10 a.m. Eastern tomorrow on mftstamps.com. Um, we also uh, have, you know, retailers carrying our stuff. So if you have a, an independent store that you love um, and they aren't carrying MFT, feel free to reach out to them and say, you know, I would really love for you to order the uh, all-star high top dynamics for me. And they might be willing to do that. So love to support our local stores as well. But otherwise, it's at mftstamps.com. All right, guys. So that is it. Thank you for being here tonight. And um, have fun with this, these products. And uh, I will see you again soon. All right. Take care, everybody. Good night. <laughs>